Hi, another edition of Two Days with Corey here. I'm Corey, and I'm here because we've gotten some direct feedback or questions around what does our data centers look like? What do we do inside them? How do they run? What makes them cool, right? And uh, I'm actually here with, I don't have the data, I'm here with the data center. No. Hello. Uh, <laughs> no, really. This is our US West data center. Yeah. So <laughs> All he's of it. really smart. <laughs> no, I'm not, no. This is the next best thing to actually taking you into a data center. Uh, and so, I, Michael, I wanted to hear a little bit about what you do, uh, you know, what you focus on, and sort of what makes our data center super cool. Okay, cool, yeah. So I'm principal data center architect here at Microsoft, uh, one of a very small number of people focused on building out, yeah, these massive structures that house, you know, millions and millions of machines at the same time. That's cool. And uh, yeah, we wish we could get everybody in to tour them around. Obviously, yeah, sure. you know, you, yeah. you, you do give away a little bit of the special sauce when you do yeah. that. Yeah. Um, but the thing that the thing that people would be impressed with, for the most part, if they're not used to the data center market, is the sheer scale. Yeah. I mean, they are enormous. Yeah. It's not uncommon for us to have a single site with you know a hundred thousand servers yeah. running at the same time doing pretty unified workloads. That's so awesome. um, that's really you know the nature of the cloud. So yeah. it's pretty cool to walk in and just see just you know millions and millions of little green blinking LED lights. Right. Um, so I have a little I have a little garden in, in my backyard that's got one hydrangea. How many hydrangea do you think could fit in one of our data centers? Oh man, well, just see, for scale, just for people yeah, to really so yeah. Because I mean, no one knows how big a computer is. So yeah. I'm gonna try and put it in something yeah, that they so know how big our, it is. Our Quincy campus you could probably get two million of those. Two million under hydrangea. The roof. Yeah probably that's awesome. pretty easily. When could I when could I get my hands on that space. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> if you've got enough money, we can deal with it. We can we can do a deal exactly. here. Okay. But we're cheap though, so don't okay, worry about it. That's true. Know. Very inexpensive. That's right. Per, high value. Per, per high hydrangea. value. Per hydrangea. Per hydrangea. We're pretty cheap. Yeah. That's actually how we do most of the calculations, not by power, but by hydrangea. Yeah, exactly. We're working on vertical farming next, so we're going to do, you know, <laughs> tomatoes on one side, data center Hydro on the other. Yes, yeah, exactly. fantastic. So what else would you say if there's one like really cool thing about sort of what we do? Anything about power or green or, you know, what would you say something Yeah, cool? well, so green energy, we are the largest green energy buyer in the United States oh, in awesome. terms of data centers. So yeah. we buy more hydropower and renewables Super. than anybody else. Um, the other one is that efficiency, right? So at scale, you can make trade-offs that other people simply can't do. Uh -huh. Like, so for us, if we say, geez, we should really invest, you know, $500,000 in developer time to go put this feature on, yeah. but it's only going to raise the, the overall efficiency of the servers in the fleet by 1%. Yeah, 1% of 5 million machines running at the same time. It's awesome. It yes. starts to be huge. Yes, so right. you'll make those investments right. where other guys just can't do it. That's, right. That's really it. Yeah, so it's kind of cool to actually have those discussions where it's not a question of, well, should we do it? It's, no, no, you should do all of it. That's right. Do all of it. So. Yeah, it's been funny. I think uh, uh, in my experiences, uh, you know, it's the first time that every percentage point, like, really, really, really matters because the scale is just so ridiculous. Yeah, yeah exactly. And things are insidious. Like, it's you find that at scale, you know, you, you make this one trade that you say, well, it only gets me 1% more power efficient, but it also saves me 10% of my bandwidth, and it also saves me three acres of purchase of land, and it, you know, it's, it's sort of all exponentially kind of carries out. It's kind of creepy, I would That's super cool. And yeah. all that adds up to why we can offer very agile and very low price. Yeah, I mean that's solutions. the public cloud market. Right? Like we know that the public cloud market is going to want to see a price trend like this. Yeah, that's right. So what you do then is you say, look, you got to embrace that, and that's you go right. after it. And you say, put the engineers on it, so and get say, ahead of it. That's, that's it. Right. You're just going to be on that's it. That's right. So. Very cool. Very cool. Yeah. Well, thank you so much for your time. I got a question. Oh, okay. The man behind the camera is allowed to speak, huh? This is new. This is new. <laughs> <laughs> what do you say is probably our coolest data center that we have out there? Oh wow. The coolest data center. I personally, because I've worked for a long time on what what has driven our Bing platform for quite a while, so I like the modular platform a lot. Um, it's just a really like the small little machines and really, really super efficient um, and built for, you know, a very specific purpose. But I like those a lot. Mm. Uh, we have them in a few places and there are some spots publicly that we uh, talk a little bit about those. I like those. Um, the flagship campus in Quincy is probably the neatest place to go visit because it has all of the generations of what we've done. And that's so. just that's just up north, right? Yeah, it's or about three, hour, three hours from north here in Redmond. Yeah. Okay, cool. All right. Yeah. Very good. Hey, thank you so much for your time. Yeah, awesome. this was fantastic. It was good to talk to you. Yeah. And maybe we will get up to to Quincy or someplace. I know. We got to uh, ask. Point. We got to get tours. Yeah, 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 got to yeah. get tours. Okay, we'll get we'll, we'll get we'll take care of that. So <laughs> thanks again. Yeah, awesome. And uh, thank you. Hope you enjoyed this. Please let me know if you got any questions. Uh, you can hit me up on pound sign or hashtag Azure TWC. And uh, thank you very much. Give us your comments and uh, have a good day. Thanks, man. All right, cool, man. Yeah, absolutely. Really nice talking to you.